Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to install Comeback Gameplay Overhaul with Nemesis in Mod Organizer. This video is made possible by the support of my viewers and Patreon subscribers. Before we begin, this tutorial is meant for new users and familiar with the Nemesis Behavior Engine and I will show you the simplest way possible to install Comeback Gameplay Overhaul. To begin, we need to download all the required mods. Download links are provided in the video description below. To install Combat Gameplay Overhaul, we need first to download Nemesis Behavior Engine and Combat Gameplay Overhaul. After you have downloaded all the required mods, we will need to install them using Mod Organizer. First, click on the Download tab on Mod Organizer and install Nemesis Behavior Engine. At the time of making this tutorial, the latest version is 0.84 Beta. Be sure to install the latest version always. Click OK and wait for it to be installed. It will take some time to install because it contains over 9,000 files. After we're done installing Nemesis, we are going to install Combat Gameplay Overhaul. Again, click on the file and wait for it to be installed. Now that we have both mods installed, click on the boxes on the left panel to activate them. Now comes the hardest part. We are going to add the Nemesis executable in Mod Organizer. First, go to the drop down menu as shown and click the Edit option. Then click the plus button and add from file. Here you will have to locate the folder path of where you installed Nemesis. Everyone's folder locations will be different. The most common location should be your Skyrim Steam folder or Mod Organizer folder. For my game, Nemesis is installed in Mod Organizer 2 slash Skyrim SE slash mods slash Nemesis slash Nemesis Engine slash Nemesis Unlimited Behavior Engine. Now double click on the Nemesis Unlimited Behavior Engine application icon. Click OK to finish the process. We have just finished adding the Nemesis executable and now we are going to run that executable in order to make combat gameplay overhaul work in the game. Go to the drop down menu and select Nemesis Unlimited Behavior Engine. Click Run. This is the patching menu. Before we do anything with it, we must first update the engine. Click on the Update Engine button and wait for it to finish. Now we're going to select Combat Gameplay Overhaul SE from the patching menu. As you can see, there are other mods on the menu. Only select them if you are using those mods. If you select the wrong mod, the game will not work. After you selected the mod, click on the Launch button wait for the process to finish. Most people will encounter issues in this stage. Common causes for this stage to fail are that you're using an outdated Nemesis engine, or you didn't run the engine through Mod Organizer, or you selected the incorrect mod in the patching menu. When the patching process is done, you can close the menu. Now comes the final step. We are going to run the game. Go to the drop down menu, click SKSE and run the game. Once you're in the game, the first thing you will want to do is to open the MCM menu and configure the mod. In the MCM menu, you set things like grip hotkeys and damage multiplier. Move around and test the new combat system. Now this concludes the tutorial on how to install Combat Gameplay Overhaul with Nemesis in Mod Organizer. If you found this video informative and would like to see more in the future, please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and Patreon. 
Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.